Got let, let me remember, one, two, three, put on a happy face. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we are here at Hamcation 2023. This is the first look, my first look. This is my first look at the new Icon IC905. I'm going to call it a 705. I know, I know. I'm going to. So I've, this I've tripped on it a few times <laughs> myself. Icom IC905 with all of the bands. This is the ultimate, this is what I was thinking when we were doing that interview. This is the ultimate example of use it or lose it on these frequencies and these bands. Yes. Because there's nothing else out there that's commercially made like this. So uh, we're going to get into Ray telling us all about this radio right now. You've got uh, the RF module, you've got the 10 gigahertz. It, 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 yeah, here, here we yeah. go. We got the 905 head. We've got the speaker microphone that comes with it. So, again, when uh, we we're talking earlier about soda microwave, mm -hmm. that's the same microphone for the 705. Is it the same two yeah. plug, two wire connection? Yes, sir. Oh, yeah, it's identical. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. It's, it's identical. So, I mean, it just, it just feels like soda, soda mm -hmm. microwave all over it. We've got DC power coming into the radio on one side of the backpack. We've got the uh, power over Ethernet cable going to the main body out the other side. We are using the smaller one of the two. Hmm. And now, that's in the kit, right? That, 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 that is in the kit. It's in the, okay. kit. the body with the 905, we've got a, a N-type connector for 2 meters, 70 centimeters. Mm -hmm. Then uh, we have 2.4, and uh, yeah, I know we're going to get critiqued about the jumper and everything, but <laughs> you're good, you're hey, good. we're at a ham fest. <laughs> That's you, right. You kludge whatever you can. We're just lucky you have it here. But this one's 2.4. Mm -hmm. We do not have a GPS antenna connected to it. That's what this plug is. And then you've got the 5.6. Okay. So two meter, 70 centimeters, 1.2. Oh. Is that a tri-band uh, type-in connector? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> hey, learned something new here. <laughs> Two meters, 70 centimeter, 23 centimeter <laughs> on the end type yeah. connector. Yeah, yeah. Then 2.4, 5.9. So five bands right. come with the radio. Mm -hmm. And okay. if you want to go to 10, you need the expansion. Yes, right. then you got the 10 gig module right. that okay. we feed from 2.4. It's a transverter off of 2.4. So it goes here. If you're on 2.4, you bypass. This is a 2.4 antenna. Okay. And then we've got the 10 gig antenna. Oh, I see. And that's these up here, right? So when we look at here, the way that we go, I'm sorry, 2.4, 5.6, uh -huh. and 10 gig. Okay. Now, one thing real quick, <clears throat> I will let you guys add on your version of let's read the Smith charts. <laughs> but here's the Smith charts, 2.4, 5.6, and 10 gig. And wow. that's vertical alignment. So you can see the bigger yeah. lobes are there at the bottom. Right. So you're already, that goes back to the whole soda discussion, right? Because you set this up on a mountaintop and you're beaming down to whomever is down right. there. Yes. Right. Now we, yeah. we kind of set it up with the 10 gig far away. Uh, we will have a parabolic dish available yeah, for sure. a high gain okay. parabolic that we're going to bring in. And there's no reason that anyone can obviously make their own. Right? They're doing it already. <laughs> right, yeah. Right, right. yeah. Now one of the other caveats, sorry to walk in front of the camera. No, one of the other front. caveats is this is the, the regular hams type SHF product. It's got everything that you need to get on these bands and operate. I know the, the aficionados, the, the, the guys that really do heavy-duty SHF are going to critique it, and they're going, well, it doesn't do this, it doesn't do that. I'm sorry, guys. This is first-generation, commercially available, off-the-shelf type product. Mm -hmm. um, for what it does, it, it, it does a lot. Well, name me something else that does this. That's not homemade. Right, right. That's not homemade. Right. There right. is no. There is. There, there is nothing. And, and as far as I'm concerned, like you know, the big point that Will was always mentioning is that, again, these are kind of underused, utilized bands. I, right. Yeah, I was about to say and that. This is, you're, you're basically one of the, this, as far as I'm concerned, the only manufacturer yeah. that's kind of leaning into making something right. like this. Now, one of the cool things, and Josh, you and I stumbled across this while setting it up. Yeah. Was the span for the scope is different than on the 705. Okay. I kept hitting the span button and it would come up and disappear. 
There's a minus and a plus, ah. like we have on the R9500 and the R8600 to expand it. Right now, we're looking at 25 meg. That is the, the max, plus or minus 25 meg. Mm -hmm. Then 10, 5, 2.5. I mean, it'll go down to the ridiculous for 10 gig at plus or minus 2.5 kilohertz. That's crazy. And, you and one other thing, you push and hold it, and it will go from one end to the I other. I saw that, yeah, you, you just kind of long pressed it and, it, and it moved by itself, yeah, okay. So does the head of the, the radio do anything by itself, I guess is my question. You have to have these modules connected. Yeah, you have okay. to have these modules okay. because... Okay. Um, We're in a high frequency. Right. Well, I didn't know if it would do two meter, 70 centimeter, and 1.2 oh, by yeah, itself. No. Yeah. Yeah. So, oh, there's so nothing Jason on the back of it. Oh, wow. It has to be externally powered. <laughs> it's a heat sink. Yeah, it's okay. a heat sink because the radio does power over okay. Ethernet. Gotcha. Yep, yep. Uh, a full-size SD card. For all those wondering, that is a USB-C port. USB-C. Uh-oh, USB-C. <laughs> yeah. And then a LAN connection. <laughs> okay. Have not gotten that far, and I'd mentioned on another podcast that I know... The viewers are going to go, RTFM, right? Know this radio. Read the fine manual. Mm -hmm. yeah. Don't have one yet. So yeah. <laughs> we're, we're learning by experimentation right. and bad habits. <laughs> also, on the bottom of the radio, uh -huh. it lays out what your connections are on this oh, side okay. here. A little chart down it, there. it is imprinted, but I can't read that anymore. Yeah. But I can make out this mm -hmm. much better. And it will do amateur television analog, not digital, correct? That is correct. Okay. At this time. Yes. There has been discussions about updates. Don't know for sure. Okay. That's pure speculation at this point. Okay. But there's all your bands right there. Wow, look at that. That functionality is still the same. Same interface. 7300. Yep. Uh, 705. The modes, of, the modes as well. In fact, yeah. Yeah, why don't you click on modes next? Go to modes. Now, the one thing about it, it is amateur band only. There is no extended receive. Um, uh, like the 9700. The bands. Yeah, yeah. The bands are specifically ham bands only. Right. Um, I know it's going to sound, sound a little sarcastic, but got to say it. If you want something that receives DC to daylight. We've got the R8600, we've got the R9500. Those will work perfectly for that application. Gotcha. Yeah, click on bands, that was, uh, or the modes, yeah. There we go on the modes. SSB, CW, RTTY, AM, ATV, FM. Click on ATV. Let's see it. Oh, hey! <laughs> we have audio. Menu, hit menu. Uh, the menu button. And go, where's the decode? Is there a decode? Because you're ATV right now, right? Right. Video. Hey! Look at that. Look at that. Oh, That's look at that. Cool. Oh, like. Oh, I love it. Now, if an episode of I Love Lucy came up there, I'd be really impressed. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> that, is, that, is real, that is really cool. So, the obvious question then, what do you hook up to be the transmitter? The TX, if you had a video supply A camera? It's got the composite out input, right? Electric key, in. external speaker, mic speakerphone, mic. AVN. Yeah. AVN. Is that AVN yeah. right yeah. there? Right there. So it's a. Oh, yeah, it's I don't. A, I don't have my glasses. You can literally on, so. three point camera to it. Yeah, yeah. That's well, awesome. you you'd have to if you want to do two AATV. So. Sure, 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 sure. But still, I mean, that's. So it looks like that. Those are all 3.5 millimeter jacks. Uh, yes. Yeah. Okay. 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 That's awesome. I just that need a webcam. Awesome. Webcam with 3.5 millimeter. Yeah. Now, now I don't know if anybody's. I don't know if anybody's yeah. picked this up, but on all the Icon radios that have the M scope, uh -huh. yeah. you don't have to go in the menu and pick scope. Down. You, you just, just push and hold it. That's right. Hey, I figured that out, and if I I can figure it out, anybody can. So yes, I, I actually knew that. It's one of the few things I knew. But there, hey man, but, what's up? But that's just you? going to show. We like to keep things consistent. We come out with yeah. a new radio. It doesn't need to, to be something altogether new. So the, the manual might not be open a whole lot. Right. So right, right here, our right. span, we're looking at minus 25 to plus 25. Yeah. You can see we're out of band at this point. So then we. So it won't receive below like 430 then? No. Right. So just hand bands only. Right. Okay. Yeah, you were mentioning that. That's just a good visual example of it. Cool. Filter setups you can, or for the screen, you can do either center or fixed. 
I mean, it, beyond it's, yeah, it's beyond like that, it feels game. just like yeah. the 705. Yeah. I mean, that's what we expect, right? Yeah. Right on. All right, Ray. Well, this is. I'm excited. Yep. You wanna uh, you wanna tell us uh, what you think the price might be? No, I can't <laughs> see. It. See, I, I can't. I was I, I wasn't gonna ask, ask that. I was gonna ask. I was gonna ask if you had a release date in mind. Well, I'll take that next. Yeah. Yeah. I, I got a I got a release date that I hope for, but I'm not gonna say it. I don't okay. wanna jinx it. Anything. I already know what you're thinking. You're, you're thinking the next time we all get together. Sometime, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Sometime. I didn't want to say it. He said How about that? To... Sometime this year. Sometime okay. this year, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. Ray, thank you so much. Maybe, maybe it. him. All right. Any, so. any other specific questions? I, no, that, that answered everything I needed to know. You're going to sell it as a kit, though, Ray. It'll, it'll come with the backpack. The 10, the 10 gigs is going to be an option. Gig, but everything else will come as a, as a kit. Well, the 10 gigs an option. Yeah. So are the antennas. The antennas are an option, too. Yes. Okay, okay, okay. And, and so is the backpack. Oh, it doesn't come, the kit doesn't come with a backpack? No. Right. In fact, that was something that, that just dreamed of doing was sewed. I'm like, wow, the head's exactly the same. It will fit. And, and like, like I was telling Josh, I got laughed at the first time I mentioned about wanting to use the backpack for it. Oh. The backpack's great. It is. I, it's, it's great. It's, the, the only thing I worry about is for, the, for this body to put it in the backpack, yep. this does get pinched a little bit. Oh, yeah. Okay. So if it was just a little bit taller, yeah. this would have to be in a separate add-on pack for it. And you'd want to yeah. shorten up your cable because there's no way that you'd want to lug something like this. No, there's no reason to do that. Okay. But uh, yeah. it is PoE. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, it, it, it's a, so far we've had a lot of fun putting it together. Good, good. Thanks for your time today, man. I hope you all have a great show. All right, man. Appreciate it.